hear explosions. It's another corrupted long leg. It's all that's left though, I might just be able to ignore it. Which would be pretty pog. I think it's kind of right along the way, but I might be able to just barely avoid it by going slightly left. Don't mind me, bud. I'll be right out of your hair. Is this, a, this is unclimbable. No, I think I have to go that way. Looks like I need to get up right there. Just stay out of the way for now. Oh dear. You don't see anything. I don't see how to get up right there. Oh, now I see. Oh, do I climb up the side of this? No, I climb up right there. Go on, bud. Go back to your patrol. I'll get out of your way. Mm, get away from me. Sound strike. Figured that wouldn't kill you, but kind of felt like I had to go for it at that point. Hey, what if you were on fire? Ow! I'd like you to be on fire a little bit faster than that. Blow up. Oh, I'm down here now. Totally on purpose. How am I missing you? There we go. Not done yet. All things considered, also could have gone a lot worse. So right here is where I needed to go. The fact that there are uh, there's tall grass here leads me to believe I could have stealthed my way through this, but. I got in a bit of a rough spot right out the gate, and I was like, ah, let's just murder everything. Explosions in the distance. Pay that no mind. Doesn't concern you. The way you say that makes me think it concerns me. A lot of corrupted scrappers around here, huh? Boy, oh boy. So far, so good. We're gonna try our darndest to actually stealth this. Thank you, long dodge roll. can go up the left here and hope there's some tall grass, or I can just go straight across here. After these guys aren't both looking right at me. Yeah, just some explosions, nothing to worry about, no big deal. Don't you worry. That one's gone, turn around please. Turn around please, thank you. Go. Shouldn't have jumped there, but we're fine. Wish I could grab that medicine be able to go around this way and be safe. Another one up there. I'm worried about stepping out of the grass when that one's looking this way. All right. Getting no, that one's now. coming around here. Head for that ridge. Actually, now I should be able to do this. Oh dear. We're fine. I didn't have an exact destination in mind when I made that first roll and after I made it, I was like, "Oh no. <laughs> what now?" I think I have to walk right up here, but I don't know where I'm- Is that tall grass right there? I don't think it is. I don't know where I'm gonna hide from that one. Arietta, welcome to stream. When's the next Tales of Fantasia stream? Uh, tomorrow should be. Should be doing Fantasia tomorrow. Starting at 2 CST. This is tall grass right here. Okay, I couldn't quite tell from down below. And then we go right up there when this guy walks away. Tall legs just over this ridge. You'll see it when you reach the top. Now be ready to act fast. You need to get in and get it done before they raise an alarm. I'm a gamer. Please. Okay, there we go. Here we go. You getting this? I see the legs of a tall neck down there, but no tall neck. Damn. 
The transmitter's been moved. Check down the ravine to the left. Only place it could be. <sighs> so much for your insider knowledge. Toward the explosions. Great. You got exactly one shot at this Aloy, so spare the sarcasm and make it count. You see that bridge over the ravine? Yep. Memorize its location. There's a repel point on the side. That'll be your way out. And these Eclipse troopers? Avoid them, or kill them, your choice. The blasting should cover any noise you make. Find the tall neck and destroy the module on top. I do like... Here we go. I do like eliminating. My first night off the shadow shift in a whole week. There are quite a few of them, though. Never complain. The shadow will deliver us. I do prefer stealth by removing bodies instead of just stealthing away from everything, you know what I mean? Like, my favorite kind of stealth is when you move around and kill people systematically to give yourself more space to work with. Nice. Hate these guys with containers on that their backs. Not be one of ours. Totally not one of yours. Totally not. There we go. Nothing to complain about. That shelter bigger than the others. Find the tall neck, Aloy. There's no time to poke around. There is if I make time. Yeah, I do what I want. Oh! It went through his mask. That was close. It shouldn't have been close, but it was. Dang it. I wanted that shot. Can I get this person from, like, this corner? Like, right? Yeah! I'm worried I'm gonna clip that line. Nah, we're good. I'm so upset. Using the wrong bows for this. Where did they go? Where did they go? I wonder. Come around this corner, fool. Thank goodness that didn't clip the top of that. Where's the heavy dude? There Is should be a heavy dude somewhere. Ahead? No. It's a mining operation. So long as you're quick, it won't affect you. Oh good, another secret. I do love secrets. I thought that there was a skull dude around here somewhere. Did I kill him already without realizing? Alright. Got a little dicey at the last second there, but we made it work, chat. Ooh, what's that? Oh, a signal's nearby. Hello. Edaman coddled? So long as King Edaman languishes at sunfall, coddled by his mother. He will never learn the true lessons of the sun. I have tried to instruct him, but the shadow of his mother's influence is upon him. I took him to the palace balcony to behold an offering of sacrifice in the ring, but he showed no thirst for it. He averted his gaze. Look to the sun, I told him. Do not shield your eyes. In all things, it is absolute. One day, it nurtures life, and the next, scorches life away. It burns the skin of champions and wretches alike. Never does the sun show pity. That is the example a Sun King must follow. The example of your father. But before my instruction could take hold, she was there. Clutching him to her robes, burying his face against her breast. How is a king to rule when he cannot even see? 
The Mad Sun King's name is Jiran, right? Is Edaman is Avad? Is Avad Edaman? Was that like his name before? Because Helis. Helis isn't that old. Because we saw Helis at the start of the game when he fought Ross. Like, Helis looks like his. I don't know. Late 30s, mid 40s kind of deal? Oh my goodness, there's a lot of data points. My lord, the 13th king of the Kaja Sundom was murdered. Cut down by cowards who mistook firm rule for madness. Ever the strong are beset upon by the weak. So he said, as the traitors launch their assault, as their cannons forged by Asaram filth topple the battlements and burst the gates, I would have fought to the end. But it was his will, the will of the sun, that I lead the prince and queen into the west, to safety. My lord did not hesitate. He saw his fate. He looked into the sun, and he did not blink. With me, he sent kestrels, nobles, sun priests, and slaves. Killing all that stood in the way, I carved a path to Sunfall. There, we joined others to gather the strength to take back our home. But our strength only faded until the buried shadow was brought to light. Yo, staring straight into the sun without blinking is not good for your eyes, brother. That is not good. Yo, what's up, Lone Wolf? Welcome to stream, dude. How's it going, brother? Who is Edaman? Did Avad have a brother? I don't remember who Edaman is. I guess we'll figure out as we go more. I don't think we've heard that name until now. When I first set eyes on the buried shadow, I trembled. Was I not the chosen of the sun? A blazing light of faith to shred and scatter darkness. Was it not my place to destroy this devil? But High Priest Bahavas instructed me in the prophecy, and set right my frame of mind. The murder of the true Sun King broke the cosmic cycle short of completion. The whole world cast into darkness, doomed. To resume and turn the Wheel of Time would require more than sun and faith. All forces must combine. All halves of nature join to one cause. Shadow to sun, night to day. Even a buried shadow wants the wheel to turn. For without a sun in the sky, there can be no shadow. Never does the sun show pity. And yet, when my wife died in birthing, and in dying into the life of my child unborn, I pitied myself. My lord sensed this, but instead of casting me down for weakness, he cast upon me a radiant beam of honor. He ordered my kin buried in the sacred caves reserved for royals and heroes. Unimaginable. Never again would I doubt that I am the chosen of the sun. Never again would pity find a place in me, not for myself or another. When sleep refuses to come, I think of our wedding night. How you welcomed me to the marital bed. How after, when you fell asleep, I lay there watching your delicate face. For all its beauty, I detested its fragility. A rage swelled up inside me. I abhorred that bed, how its softness threatened to swallow us up. And that room, the stench of incense, the fine embroidery of the drapes, all of it weak. I slipped from the bed, threw open the casement, and lay naked on the stone floor. Determined to spurn all seductions of comfort. But when I woke the next morning, you lay beside me, naked as I in the cold. Your body, stretched beside mine, seemed chiseled from stone. I saw you wake, instantly alert, like an animal ready to strike. You said nothing. You did not have to. 
already you had shown me beyond doubt that we were meant to be. What is this place? A distraction. There are several data points. Man, Helis and uh, his his wife were some some wild people. Pretty crazy. What's this about? Ceremonial armor. Okay. Neat, neat. Fine. Oh, there's another data point. Or data point. Every morning, I wake to the same nightmare. The same reality. Holy Meridian, in the hands of profligates. Debased. The spire, towering above the horizon like in a glittering spike through the center of my mind. Every daybreak in exile is a mark of failure. But the count of days runs thin. I will see Meridian retaken. The profligates slaughtered. A true king restored to the Mesa throne. In this, I have become an instrument of prophecy. This armor. There's only one man big enough to wear this. Helis. Definitely no other man has ever been as swole as Helis. Not exactly fancy. What would you expect of a fanatic? His only extravagance is his brutality. So you know him? Just enough to want to stop him. Yeah, he's pretty insane. Sure hope no one notices this. Did it. He's a fanatic, all right. Single-minded. It gives him a focus that you seem to lack. Now, how about finding that tall neck? It would not have been easy to drag the tall neck down this path. Why bother? Just find it and get to the top. Destroy the module and then get out fast as you can. Sure is a lot of blasting up there. Sounds busy. Busy enough not to notice you, let's hope. Let's find out. What could go wrong? I see it. They built some kind of structure around it. Climb it. The sooner this is done, the better. I don't like this. It feels wrong. Everything here is wrong. Just get to the module and destroy it. Looks like there were two different paths to take. Sorta. Oh well, this is fine. This poor tall neck being used for evil. Oh, that's a metal devil in front of us, ain't it? I see the module. Good. Now be quick. This... This is Hades? Aloy, this is not the time. Metal devil. Open the module's casing, now. Aloy, do as I say or all is lost. Uh-oh. I think he knows I'm here. Entity has come here. Entity. Miscalculated. Entity cannot destroy me. I am beyond its reach. Maybe you are, but this isn't! Destroy the entity. Oh, that's a death ringer. Ah, uh, well, goodbye, tall neck. No, not the tall neck. Dude, I'm telling you, Aloy has the strongest fingers known to mankind. Keep moving. I'm running, silence. I'm running. Oh, that's like a lot of Deathbringers over there, isn't it? No way. Whoop! Oh, I'm, I'm yeah, moving. I ain't stopping, brother. What do you think I'm doing? Taking a nap? Nap sounds nice right now. Where am I going? Where am I going? Right here. Along the side. Go, go, go. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I can't, I can't jump. There we go. Help. 
help. Drink that potion. Keep running. Oh dear. Talk about the brain trail. Don't just jump to the next one, Aloy! There. Ow. Come on. That hurt. Don't fight. Run. Oh, I'm running. Don't you worry. Hi guys. Bye guys. Woo, that was close. Are you kidding me? Doing it, doing it, doing it. I'm out! Almost out of it. Hi! The whole base is on high alert. Yeah, I noticed. Don't fight. Keep moving. I wanted to do a slow motion shot, but I didn't do well enough. More eclipse ahead. Hello, goodbye. Bridge in sight. That's the way out. Sorry, taking a drink before I go. Later, losers! Oh, thank goodness that water was there. 